Margaret Alva, who is uh, filing her nomination for the vice president's uh, race. Uh, this is uh, the opposition's choice uh, for the vice presidential uh, race. Margaret Alva is uh, the opposition candidate for the vice president. Margaret Alva, of course, uh, is uh, coming back virtually from uh, retirement to, to file this nomination. Uh, a Congress veteran, uh, she's also held uh, the post of a former union minister. She was a five-term member of parliament as well and served as the governor of many states. She practiced law before foraying into active politics. And there you have the pictures there. Rahul Gandhi, Congress uh, MP, sitting along with her as she uh, files her nominations today as uh, the as the opposition's choice for the vice presidential uh, nominee. In fact, uh, uh, this uh, was... Uh, the choice that was then pointed out by the left parties uh, who in fact uh, spoke with Margaret Alva as well. Uh, however, there is still some amount of uh, a disagreement within the opposition because we've seen at least a couple of parties not on board uh, this decision of Margaret Alva being the opposition choice. Uh, so far the in the front seats, uh, you can clearly see that it is largely the Congress uh, uh, leaders who are there uh, sitting along with Margaret Alva as she is filing her nomination papers uh, from Malikarjun Kharge. Uh, there you can also see Rahul Gandhi there. Uh, so clearly it is visible that the entire opposition perhaps is not together on this matter. However, largely, broadly, uh, the opposition has agreed to her nomination uh, or her being the nominee, opposition nominee for the vice presidential race and therefore she is filing her nomination papers today. She'll be up against the NDS choice of uh, Jagdeep Dhankar who was uh, the governor of West Bengal, a BJP veteran. He too is a lawyer by training uh, and a former national convener of the BJP's legal affairs department as well. He has uh, been at loggerheads with the chief minister of West Bengal, Mamata Banerjee for some time. In fact, as governor, that was uh, uh, the highlight uh, many a times of uh, his tenure when we saw uh, the, 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 the governor and uh, the chief minister not being on the same page. A JAT leader and likely to help the BJP in Rajasthan and Haryana elections. Jagdeep Dhankar is the NDS choice for the vice president cha presidential candidate. On the other hand, Margaret Alva is the choice for the opposition. Now, in the front rows, now that the camera has panned, you can also see uh, CPIM leader Sita Ram Yechuri. You can also see Shad Pawar sitting there, all uh, supporting Margaret Alva's uh, nomination there for the vice presidential race. Uh, that nomination is being filed currently at the moment. As I was pointing out, virtually from retirement, Margaret Alva, uh, a senior, a veteran Congress leader, has stepped out uh, and filed her nominations as uh, uh, she became the choice for the opposition for this crucial race. Uh, a Congress veteran, a former union minister, she has uh, served as a member of parliament over several terms, at least five terms, and a governor of uh, quite a few states as well. Uh, she is uh, she was a practicing uh, she was practicing law before uh, she actively stepped into uh, politics uh, uh, served as a governor in the past of goa rajasthan uttarakhand and gujarat uh, margaret alva a senior veteran leader of the congress party there in filing her nomination papers today and you can see uh, the opposition leaders who are in support of her sharat pawar uh, d raja uh, all from uh, the left the left parties the cpi cpi M. Sitaram Yechuri is also there. NCP Sharad Pawar uh, was there. Apart from that, you could also see uh, some members uh, like Ram Gopal Yadav of the Samajwadi Party as well, sitting in the second row right behind Margaret Alva as she filed her nomination papers for uh, the vice pres presidential race today. But just uh, uh, next to her, you could see uh, the senior Congress leaders sitting there from Rahul Gandhi uh, to Malikarjun Kharge. Now, you can also see uh, some of the leaders from other political political parties like the DMK. Uh, you can see Tiruchi Shiva also uh, standing there next to next to Margaret Alva as she files her nominations there uh, for the post of the vice president. So uh, a significant development there as far as uh, the opposition is concerned after they pitched uh, Yashwan Sinha against uh, Draupadi Murmu uh, for the post of uh, uh, the president. Now, uh, Ahead of the vice presidential election, they are pitching in Margaret Alva as uh, the, the nominee of the opposition for them. These are pictures uh, from...
platform just a short while back when she uh, filed those nomination papers there margaret alva signing those papers there and as uh, as i was pointing out right next to her uh, three of the senior congress leaders there malikarjun kharge rahul gandhi then on the further right you could see sharad pawar sitaram yachuri behind her you can see samajwadi party's uh, ram gopal yadav so the opposition giving a sense that despite some of the other parties in the opposition not being on board by and large this is a decision acceptable to most of the opposition parties